Good morning and welcome to the Modern Magic. My name is Dr. Madan and today I'm going to talk about the consideration of a residency interview. The first of all, like what things you should have to start with the interview. The first thing is your laptop. You should have the good laptop and the battery range. It should be more than five hours or maybe four hours. And you should have the good camera and the laptop as well. Otherwise, you know, it may be an interruption if your battery has the problem. And the most important thing is uh, two things I would say. One is the camera of the laptop and there is the mic. So make sure you should have the good camera. You can check like whether so your camera is HD. You can, if your camera is 1080, then it's good. If not, then you can use other devices. Like you can use this kind of uh, camera, additional camera. So this is the C92, like 922. This is a good camera. You can take this Logitech if you don't have the good camera on your laptop. And other things that's very important is you should like consider you should have the good mic as well mic it means like if your mic is your yeah, computer mic is okay then you can use it but but i would consider you should use your airports i would say the air the apple airports are very good you can use that because they also have the noise cancellation is but you know the noise cancellation is not working if you someone had the airport like apple airport and the window laptop so you make sure if you have the airport it's better to use the network if not then you can use other airports like the Samsung. you can use that as well and the other thing is uh, i would say that you should have the good lighting as well the good lighting it means you can use the ring light and with the stained it with it with it and your your light should be in 45 angles like i'm using i have the light in the the ring light in the back of my laptop and it's like it's so the angle is 45 you should make sure you should have the uh, ring light which is which should be at the 45 angle not more than that not less than that because if you like decrease or increase the angle of the ring light above 45 or below then you can have the shadow back back, back of your wall as well and the and the, after that i would say they consider you like if you have the good background it's very good if not then you can use like the uh white wall as well like i'm using i'm using only some simple white wall if you have the like someone had the good like someone can use you know the shelf of the book at the background but make sure if you are reading good book then you can use the uh shelf that having the book make sure whatever you're putting in your background you should have the knowledge about it because they are gonna really interested in uh, you know asking person that because it's a human nature if you see something you should have you know you should have you know some curiosity about that one this is a human nature so make sure whatever you use you should have knowledge about that all as well and then after that your look your look should be like you should be formal you should be professional you can use a three piece like like i'm wearing and the color should not be you know that that much dark like i'm using you know it's a, it's a blue it's a gray blue and you can this you know you can use this um coat as well. and your shirt and tie color should not be you know that bright it should be the light color and you should you know make a match up of your uh three piece coat with your shirt and the tie like i'm using you know this is a white color and this is a tie and the, i don't know what's the color of the tie you can search it out but make sure it's, it's, it's you know matching with your coat and the uh, coat and the shirt so and the other most thing is like i mean i was you know listening to a cold podcast of one of the program director he said your your 20 percent chase should be visible like now i am with a 15 percent maybe uh, because i have may, maybe 15 or maybe 20 percent your your chase should be visible around 15 or maybe 20 percent because if you are if you are just you know visible only your face you know it's not a good impression if you have the you know the shoulder and uh, 50 percent 15 or 20 percent chase visible then you know program director uh, you know, interview can you know look your can judge your gesture like when you are talking you know you should make sure you use your end gesture and as well as your shoulder as well not like you know the doing things and that but you should you move your shoulder maybe five to seven percent and along with i would say use your hand just 80 percent of your talk because you know if sometimes you know you can be a you know deficient of the synonym or word then you can you know sir 
him just you know can explain the interview that what you are trying to say so that's why i would say you should use your hands around 80 to 90 percent of your of your talk as well so this is very important using your hand gesture and the most important thing is your smile you should be smile because you know at least at the first one to two minutes of the interview you should be smiling you know if you are just like just like a robot no one gonna you know is impressed by your gesture i think that was the way that this was the uh all about interview consideration uh like you can add many other things if you have i think this is enough thank you so much for watching this video